I remember the first time I saw the new Iberia haircut. I was on tour, traveling along, and we had to stop in a small town called New Iberia in Louisiana. We stayed there overnight, and the next day we went to Walmart to pick up some groceries. And outside of the window, I saw the greatest haircut in the world, and I knew I had to write a song about it. And that's how I wrote the song, New Iberia Haircut. You see, the new Iberia haircut was the best haircut in the world. If you didn't have that haircut, you were a nobody. I sure do love the jello pudding. Mm hmm, that new Iberia haircut. Well, uh, one day, uh, this guy drove up in a four wheeler to my barber shop. He said, I'm going out to Lafayette. I need the best haircut in the world. I said, all right. I just kind of kept cutting. I had my eyes closed half the time. And uh, when I was done, he said thanks and left. I, I had no idea at the time it was going to become so popular. And popular it was. Not only was the new Iberia haircut the best haircut in the world, but it was also the number one single for 37 weeks straight. Right. When I first heard new Iberia haircut, I was like, that's the number one record, because No I Bear Haircut is real. You know all these rappers, oh, I have 20 million dollars, no you don't. All these punk bands, oh, I'm so hardcore, no you're not. You fucking cried when you stubbed your toe on the stairs walking up to the stage. You're a pussy. But no, No I Bear Haircut says, get a New I Bear Haircut, it's the best haircut in the world. And it, that's the truth. It doesn't get any more real than that. Get a new Iberia haircut. It's the best haircut in the world. Get a new Iberia haircut for every boy and girl. When you're going out to Lafayette, you gotta look your best. Get a new Iberia haircut. It'll be the best haircut yet.